Hey guys, this is Joseph from JoseMastery.com and welcome back to another WordPress tutorial. So in this tutorial we're going to be learning about um, how to create, make our menu a drop down menu. So without further ado, let's get started. So we've got our uh, styles here of our previous navigation tutorial and today we're gonna make it drop down so we're gonna go into our website here and let's go into our menus a word have it here and let's get uh, a actually let's just make this a drop down just like that we'll save the menu refresh the page as you can see here it kind of mucks up a little bit doesn't look very good so usually in a drop down menu it'll be something like this you hover over something and it'll just appear. So let's see how we can do that. All right. So the first thing we're gonna do now, basically, um, this, the some menus are in another UL. So we want to try to style that other UL. So I'm gonna go dot main nav, and we're gonna go UL li. So when you hover over the UL li. Alright, it's gonna affect the UL, the next UL. Um, I don't know if I'm making any sense. Basically, it's saying in the navigation, when you hover over the the next li, it will affect the next UL. Alright. <laughs> anyway, just um, basically that. So, um, you wanna type in here display block. Now, now you might be wondering why are we gonna do this. I'll show you why. So basically, we're gonna now style the navigation UL, UL. So it's the U, it's the um, unordered list inside the unordered list, which is this. So here we're just gonna go here display none, and that's just gonna get rid of it. And just to make sure, we're gonna go uh, position absolute. Uh, just scroll down, top negative no 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 pixels, and opacity zero. So there is absolutely no way the user can act can see the menu. All right, there we go. And let's give this a background color. I should know. My bad. We'll give this a background color. Of we'll, we'll make it the same as the hover cover, so I'm pretty sure it's 333. We'll save it, press the page. Now you can see it's disappeared. The about is not there anymore, but if we hover over this, um, whoops, let me see. Oh, my bad. All right, because basically you could do opacities one there, but anyway, I don't really need that. Whoops. <laughs> Anyways, now let's just refresh. Hover that, and there we go. As you can see, we have an about thing right there. So that's basically it. That's like the basics of that. And we can try if we use another sample page. We can put that underneath. Next to the about page. Save it. Refresh the page. And there we go. Now you can see it goes sideways. Now you might li want it to be like that, but if you look at this menu, it goes down. Now let's f we can fix that easily. Um, we go to our styles, and uh, we want to go to the style the ul main nav ul ul li, and we're gonna type in here display block. So now if we refresh the page, oops, it'll just go down. And yeah, so that looks, that's looking pretty good. I'm pretty proud of that. <laughs> nah, I don't know. Um, cool. And now we want to, let's see if we can do something pretty cool. So I'm going to go to .main nav, U-L-U-L-I-A, 
and inside the A, the anchor tag. And we're going to affect the hover. So this is saying inside the navigation, inside the, um, the UL of the UL. So inside of this UL, of, so we've got to start with this. And then we're going to um, start with LI, so one of these, and then the anchor tags, so this word. So the hover effect, and let's just change the color to this really nice color that blends in really nicely to this gray. And boom, that looks really nice right there. That looks pretty cool. Okay, so now let's do something else that I think we should do. Um, let's just put it here, main nav, and I'm going to go ULI dot current menu item now this will just point to the menu that you, ba you you basically just clicked and so if you're on the about a sample page we can um, affect the sample page current menu item and then a link so we're just gonna go here background color and we'll just make it a lighter gray press the page and there we go if we go blog, just like that. So that's pretty nice. Okay. Uh, yeah, so that's the drop down menu complete in this tutorial. And yeah, so I'll see you in the next tutorial. And I'm not too sure what we're going to be doing, but we'll definitely be doing something. And probably the the blog possibly but anyway guys I'll, thanks for watching please check out my website at joesmastery.com and i'll catch you next time peace